guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you've never seen me before my name is Olivia and in today's video I am going to be giving you guys a whole bunch of stocking stuffer ideas for Christmas because I'm super excited for Christmas so I'm just thinking of all the possible Christmas videos I can make because I love Christmas so much so um, without further ado let me give you guys some ideas so this video isn't really geared towards any specific age or gender or anything i've just listed a whole bunch of random stuff that are gender neutral they could be to a specific gender it could be to a specific age but just there's at least one thing on here that you can definitely get for whoever you are shopping for for the stocking stuffer so the first thing on my list is a bath bomb i love bath bombs they're so fun i particularly love like the cool like like the just not just like a regular plain circular bath bomb but i've seen like some that are like donut shaped um that i got for my birthday i just i love all the different kinds um that look cool and that are unique and not just like a plain circle so the next thing is hand warmers so this would be specific to someone that lives somewhere where it's cold or maybe they're going on vacation where it's cold but where i live uh it gets very cold and we usually need hand warmers if we're going skiing or skating or sledding or just for a walk for a long period of time. Um, so that would be a good idea. So the next thing is nail polish. Um, I know a lot of different girls love nail polish to paint their nails. Obviously, what else would you do with nail polish? So that could be a fun idea too. The next thing is something that I always get in my stocking and that is lip balm. Um, I always need lip balm like every year I need new lip balm so I just always usually get lip balm and it's very very helpful. The next thing is lotion so this could be like hand lotion or body lotion it could just be like plain old lotion it could be like scented lotion it could be really anything you want. The next thing is card games or just like small board games or games in general um, so you could get them like cards um, there's a couple different games that I have that you could put in stocking like some examples Spot It or Kittens in a Blender. Yes, you heard me right, Kittens in a Blender. It's kind of a fun game, but it's also kind of morbid, but it, it has nothing to do with Kittens in a Blender. It does, but like, anyways, if you buy it, you'll know what it is. But um, stuff like that that are small games that you could fit in a stocking. The next thing is a pencil case or a little bag or a change purse or wallet or anything like that um, that you could buy specific to whoever you are shopping for. Um, personally, I kind of need a new pencil case. Mine is like three years old. I think this is my third year using it. Um, and it's quite dirty. <laughs> so the next things are like stationary, so you could get pens, markers, pencils, highlighters. Personally, I love mild liners. I think those were in my Christmas gift ideas video, um, but you could also fit them in a stocking. Um, I just, I love stationary. You could get like post-its or pencil sharpeners or erasers or calculators or rulers anything you could literally get anything so the next thing is candy i feel like candy or chocolate is like a staple thing to have in a stocking like i don't think i've ever not had candy or chocolate even if it's just like a little tiny thing of chocolate um but it's awesome candy and chocolate is amazing so the next thing is something that could go in a stocking but it could also be expensive enough to give as an actual gift and that is jewelry. So obviously if you're getting like really expensive jewelry for like an adult, um, you're probably not gonna put it in a stocking. But if it's like maybe a little necklace for a kid or if it is like some sort of inexpensive jewelry or if you just wanna put an expensive thing of jewelry in a stocking, that works too. So the next thing is super fun and that is stickers. You could get literally any type of stickers um, geared towards whoever you are shopping for. Could be like adventure, travel stickers, or sports stickers, or TV show stickers, or whatever, whoever you're shopping for it likes. So the next thing is like a to-do list or a planner. 
Um, so I've seen like those like personalized to-do lists online where it can be, be like it has like to-do lists, it has like your goals for the day, or it has like weekly things and I love those so much. You could also get like a 2022 planner or a planner for the next year to come. Um, cause I always struggle with that last year. I actually didn't even think of getting a new planner until the year started. And then the first couple days of January when I didn't have a planner, honestly, it was like horrible. Like I completely forgot about something. Um, because I didn't have my planner because that's where I have everything I need to know so this year I actually already got my planner for next year, so Yeah, the next thing is hot chocolate or coffee or tea depending on who you're shopping for and what they like um, I usually get either tea or hot chocolate in mine It's I love it because I don't know. It's just a really fun cute treat so the next thing is a hat or a toque um, depending on where you live and if it's hot or if it's cold um, Yeah, the next thing is socks Just socks are great. I love fluffy. You get fluffy socks. You get Christmas fluffy socks You could get regular Christmas socks. You could get like Just normal plain socks you could get You know what I thought okay? I saw online there's like I kept getting this ad where it's like you can put your dog's face on socks. You should get that. And also one of my friends had these socks that have like their his parents' face on it. It was so funny. So that's a good idea. Get someone's face on socks. The next thing is a scarf or you could also get mitts or like neck warmers or balaclava depending on who you're shopping for and where you live. Um, obviously, if you don't ski, or do anything outside in like negative 15 degree weather, you're probably not going to need a neck warmer or a balaclava. Um, but you could always get mitts or a toque, uh, I already said toque, mitts or a scarf um, depending on where you live. The next thing is a face mask. Face masks are, personally I don't really like do face masks. I mean if I have one, I'll do it, but like I don't really care about face masks. Um, but I know some people love face masks, so that would be a fun idea. The next thing is a charger or just like the block to charge stuff. I know I always lose that or just an extra charger in general um, because I know in my house at least everyone's always swapping chargers because nobody has their own charger. The next thing is books. So depending on what book it is and how big the book is or who you're shopping for, um, this could also go as an actual gift. But you could also put it in a stocking. Sometimes I get uh, one book in my stocking. Sometimes I get some as presents. Um, but that could also be a fun idea to put in a stocking. The next thing is like hair accessories. So you could get like hair elastics or you could get bobby pins or hair pins or scrunchies or headbands or a hairbrush or anything involving hair. So the next thing is geared towards COVID. So you could get people masks. Um, I know in some places right now you don't even have to wear masks. Uh, where I live, we still have to wear masks everywhere. Um, but I think they're talking about like in next year, removing them like in the spring. I don't know, anyways. But that is just an idea. You could get some fabric masks. And then the other thing was hand sanitizer. Um, like a little thing hand sanitizer because, you know, you might need hand sanitizer. Last, but 100% not least, is Instax film. This is my beautiful Instax camera. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I love my Instax camera. I love it so, so much. So that's an idea if you want to get, like, I wouldn't put a, the actual camera in a stocking. Um, I'd get that as an actual gift, but um, I actually have like, containers here full of film because I don't want to ever run out of film. I feel like that would just be so sad. So Instax film, awesome, amazing because, oh, so amazing. But you know, make sure you're, who you're shopping for actually has an Instax camera uh, because Instax film without the camera would just be useless. So. That's the whole video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want more ideas, I did make a stocking stuffer ideas video last year, so you can check that out. 
You can also check out my Christmas day vlog, which is when I opened my stocking, so you can see what I got in there. You can also watch what I got for Christmas because I included what I got in my stocking in that video as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe down below if you wanna see more videos like these. Um, and join me on my journey and click the notification bell if you don't want to miss any of those videos little heads up I am doing a giveaway for Christmas So subscribe and turn the notification bells on so you don't miss that giveaway. You could like win something super duper cool So also follow me on Instagram because I post fun stuff on there and There might be sneak peeks of the giveaway before it actually goes up. I don't know. So that's all for the video Thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!